Hey guys, so for the next seven days, uh, Pact really is all about seven characters in the Bible who really go for it with their faith uh, and cross cultures and really put on display God's heart for the nations. And the first one it talks about is King Josiah. And he was the king of Israel a few generations after David. And after David, uh, the kingdom took a big dive uh, and the leaders and the kings of Israel uh, stopped living for God, lived for themselves. And King Josiah came in and started to redeem God's purpose and plan for the people of Israel. One super interesting thing about King Josiah was that he was super young. Uh, we're talking like, I think eight years old when he took the reign of king and uh, continued to reign uh, throughout his young adolescence and into his teenage years. And I think part of what made him so successful was this younger outlook on uh, leading his people. Uh, he was a little more pure of heart, a little more idealistic. Uh, and I think of the power that young people can have uh, with their faith. I think of a summer I spent uh, being a camp counselor at a camp when I was in college. And the kids that I would run into there uh, had the ones that had that fire for the Lord um, seemed unstoppable. Some of their ideas were wild and crazy, uh, and they just had a hope uh, that some of their friends they had brought with or friends back home uh, might come to church with them or start reading their Bible and enter into this faith that they had be taken on for themselves. King Josiah was maybe one of the last blips of kingly leadership that the people of Israel had that really went after a heart for God. Um, and he wasn't perfect, um, but we do see him uniting a nation and a people uh, underneath the leadership of God in their life. Uh, so as you think about your own life uh, this week, uh, think about uh, the areas in your life where you might feel like you're inadequate or too young or inexperienced. Uh, and think about King Josiah, eight years old, took over the throne. He led a people and is definitely one of the better, more godly kings that Israel had. And so don't let those things stop you from allowing God to use you. Uh, so guys, thanks so much for watching. Uh, keep checking this out. Uh, every day I'm going to keep posting about the devotional pact and just my thoughts uh, in general. So hope you're having a great day and we'll see you later. Peace.